added seven new cursed axes that break Minecraft. Like the funky axe that we can actually throw at mobs. Or an ender axe that can carve out end portal frames. And the super special dragon axe that will target end crystals before going after the dragon herself. I'm currently trying to craft our first axe here and look what we get. This mysterious craft pickaxe all right <gasps> double-sided a funky axe wait really yes really a funky axe putting it to the test let's see what happens on the first curse pickaxe oh what in the world is that thing oh wow buddy uh really recommend going back into the tree really recommend going back into the tree run for safety oh i think he just perished out there i think i'm okay Where? oh what in the world wait you dropped diamonds? Hold on a second. Okay, go ahead. Come this way. Let me lure you into the sunlight ever so carefully. Hello, my friend. Aren't you burning? There. Thank goodness. I thought you were going to survive for a second. Uh, can I just... Uh, 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 maybe. Maybe. Yes. Successfully. Oh, a third hit. Oh, no. Okay. You got one hit off on me. What? Explosive diamonds. We have five diamonds already. And perhaps some tasty yeast as well. Oh, yes. And we can craft a diamond pickaxe, but this is not a cursed pickaxe. Quickly cruise those, go like that, and we have ourselves a wooden pickaxe. Okay, what happens if I attempt to craft ourselves a stone axe? Do here we go, let's see, grab ourselves that, and the moment of truth, yes. <gasps> Wait, we can craft a stone axe, but it's a regular axe. But if we use all stone, cobblestone, technic, guys, you know, you know what I'm trying to say here. We get ourselves a solid stone axe. Ah, I think I'll go that route instead. Move along. Get out of the way. Excuse me. What happens if I go after the same log with the solid stone axe? <gasps> Wait, we got something brand new. We got ourselves anti-stone plasma. Every single block is dropping this brand new stuff. And this solid stone pickaxe is absolutely overpowered. It's breaking through blocks like bread on butter. Every single block is dropping this anti-stone plasma. And this solid stone axe is super overpowered. It's breaking through blocks like butter. I don't want to lose this stuff, though. It's plasma, which means liquid. Ah, yes. A perfect glass bottle to put it inside of. Okay, please store without ruining me. Please. <gasps> anti-stone bomb. Do we dare put this to the test right now? I don't know. I'm just going to eat it. Oh, what? The anti-stone bomb just cleared all the blocks. Bring in my solid stone axe. Grab two more of these bombs. I don't know. Can I throw it over there? Look at it. Go. What? Throw that one. Oh, my word. <gasps> There's a mine shaft there. <gasps> I turned every mob into this dangerous wooden mob or not so dangerous. Here, eat my funky axe. <gasps> it just turned him into a tree. Well, not technically. I think technically he got taken out and then the tree came in its place. Look, watch. Oh, never mind. Hey, buddy, check this out. Watch. Oh, gotcha. Oh, golly. Let's see what else we might find down here. That direction or that direction. I'm going this way. Yeah. <gasps> Ouch. Oh, that was an accident. That was definitely an accident. Oh, no. I lost all my goods. My poor furnace with all of my iron just got anti-stone plasma to oblivion. That's okay. No problem. I don't feel bad about it. I don't feel bad about it at all. And this lava is giving me an idea for another curse axe. Grab ourselves three buckets here and we've got our iron axe. Now I just gotta get up to the source there without burning myself. I'll go this way. Good. Oh, excuse me, buddy. Bad idea. Uh, yep, I got a funky axe for you. And now I can swoop up some lava, hopefully, maybe, all the way over there. Oh my gosh. Just one bucket? All of this waterfall in one bucket only? That's okay, no problem. Two buckets, three buckets. Yes. Combine the lava with our iron axe and grab ourselves another mysterious axe. Craft pickaxe. <gasps> This thing, molten iron. Insert molten death into any vein. A vein like this? Wait, we can break it. How does it work? It's not even swinging. What? Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, you die in the lava. <gasps> hey, but we just inserted. How do I insert the molten death? Oh, there we go. Wait, can I break this now? It's not dropping anything. What if I break it with the stone? Oh, my word. Wait, what was...
was that? Do I dare go down? I dare. I dare. I dare. I dare. I dare. I'm going for it. I got it. Whatever it was that dropped. I got it. I got my hands on it. We got ourselves another item. The molten orb. Uh, might be a little too hot to touch, but we can't throw it in bus blocks, which, ooh, be very careful. Can this break bedrock? It does. It breaks bedrock. Oh my word. Wait, all the way to the void? Uh, yep, certainly to the void. Be very careful with these things, apparently. These molten death orbs may be better than I initially thought. I've got a genius idea. Ooh, clear this up. I probably can molten orb all of this obsidian. Ooh, it might be lava, though, down there. So, yep, be very careful. We'll grab some of that. There we go. Ooh, diamonds. Fancy. Yes. Oh, I wasted it. Careful. Yes. Ooh. Oh, bye. <gasps> and the molten death orbs also instantly smelt everything, which means I can now have plenty of free gold waiting around for me. Very good. That'll be useful. Or combine it with the molten death orbs and we get the lava extractor axe. Lava extractor axe? Really? Oh, yes, really. What is... <gasps> oh, my word. Folks, blaze rods. Blaze rods. Oh my gosh. Three blaze rods everywhere. This would perhaps be the most dangerous thing I've ever done, but I'm feeling fairly confident now. We are farming unlimited blaze rods from this lava. All right, I'm afraid to get out of here. I'm just a tad fearful of climbing out of here. If I take my hands off the lava extractor axe, I may fall into the lava. We're gonna do this the slow way. And just like that, we've got 52 blaze rods. <laughs> baby. But this molten extractor lava pickaxe gets even better than that. Just very carefully whack one guy. <gasps> I'm so glad that happened when it did because that was about to go very poorly, but the molten lava extractor axe, these names are insane, actually connects fire to all of the mobs and they go down instantly. All right, that's all I needed to know. We'll craft ourselves another mysterious axe instead. The craft pickaxe. Again, and we get ourselves a cursed nether axe. Find a connection to the nether to unleash this powerful axe. A connection to the nether. Could it be a nether portal? A connection to the nether. A connection to the nether. It's got to be a mob that's also in the nether, which means skeleton. And I know there's got to be one somewhere in this mine shaft, even though I just took all of them down. Yes. Hello. I need to borrow you if my suspicions are correct. I'm so sorry, but you're going to have to go down with my... <gasps> Cursed nether axe. Oh my word, we just spawned in unlimited nether portals. Well, buddy, you were actually quite convenient. I'm gonna hold on to you for a while. You've got a home with me now. All right, let's see what this thing can do in the nether. I've got a real need right now for this axe to be just as good in the nether as it is in the overworld. I, yep. Oh gosh, wow, that was insane. What just happened? Oh boy. I think I got myself in a bunch of a pickle right now. That was a close call. What in the world just happened? I have no idea. I got so scared. I see you. I see you. Here you go. Again. Oh, you turned into an Enderman. Oh, and then I can instantly kill you as an Enderman. What? And you're dropping me Ender Pearls. Wait, that should mean. Uh, does it work on you? Yes, it does. Oh, oh no. I had too much action. I missed my swing and then I thought. All right, my new strategy is be a tad more careful. Quickly go for you instantly, and then quickly go for you instantly. Gotcha. Thank you for that. Appreciate it. Anybody else coming this direction? Watch out. Do not mess with me. I will turn you into an Enderman, and then I will extract an Ender Pearl out of you. Like you, little guy. Hey. There you go. One down. The other one's around here somewhere. Yes. The next victim. Gotcha. Gotcha. Boom, boom. Ooh. Ooh, I almost lost my pearl in the lava. All right, I'm taking these blaze rods and ender pearls back to the overworld, folks. Oh, yes. Hello. Great to see you guys again. You mind if I stop by for just a single night's rest? Yes, pardon me. Uh, gonna have to steal that. Thank you. <gasps> Some quiet and comfort, finally. And now we take these blaze rods and ender pearls to new heights. Another cursed axe. Craft pickaxe. What do we get? An ender axe. Should I have kept this in the nether? This might be too powerful. Whoa, we can bring the nether to the overworld. 
Oh my word! Look at this axe! It can change the landscape, the entire biome, into a warped forest. Look at what we've created! It's like a single warped forest biome! Ooh, hell, zombie's finding his place comfortably at home, chasing a villager around in the warped forest. Don't worry, buddy! I got you! Hold on, coming in with the funky axe! Yes! <laughs> and we brought one tree to the warped biome! Oh my gosh, give me. Oh, we just broke Minecraft. If we hadn't already, we can use our ender axe and farm end portal frames. Oh my word. We are cutting them out of the warp stems. Look at this magic right here. Wait, does this work for every block? No, it doesn't. It just works for the warp stems. And 64. Nothing like a few extra just for comfort. Bum, bum. Build out the end portal frame. There we go. Little blaze powder. And now the most powerful thing thing of all the eyes of ender and we can now get to the end to craft our final cursed axe just do it carefully excellent can i use the nether axe in order to break this we can use an iron axe instead because this next axe is about to be completely off the rails and take a quick sidestep and finalize our last cursed axe craft pickaxe the dragon axe let me up let me up now. Take this dragon axe to Mrs. Dragon herself. Where is she? There she is. Oh, you're perching right now. Don't make it easy for me. Toss it out. Wait for it. Wait for it. It destroys all of... Oh, no, 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 no. I still win. Even from the death, the axe is still traveling around. I can still come out on top. Just wait for it. Mrs. Dragon really did the one thing in order to stop my viewing experience of her death. And every crystal down Mrs. Dragon goes down too.